one of the flagship ships of the Russian Navy, the Moscow, was shot down by Ukraine. Russia initially denied this situation and announced that there was a fire on the ship. The veil of mystery over the incident was finally opened, and the Russian side admitted that the ship had sunk. However, the allegations about this particular ship are not decimated. On April 13, a major damage to the Moscow cruiser was caused by a fire as a result of an ammunition explosion. The efforts of the crew to extinguish the fire were fruitless. One soldier was killed, one soldier was injured, 27 people were lost. In the struggle to avoid damage to the ship, the remaining 396 crew members were evacuated from the cruiser to the ships of the Black Sea Fleet in the region and shipped to Sevastopol. This official statement of the Russian Defense Ministry was reported on April 22. There are still echoes of Ukraine shooting down Moscow, the flagship of Russia's Black Sea Fleet. The Russian side stated that support would be provided to the families of the soldiers who lost their lives, were injured and were missing, while the rescued sailors would continue their duties on other military ships in the Black Sea Fleet. Allegations about the sinking ship continue to come one after another. According to Forbes news and headlines reflected in the British media, Russia has not given up on Moscow. Russian President Vladimir Putin has issued orders for the urgent search of military equipment on board and everything that may be a state secret, and for it to be removed from the place where it sank and put under protection. It was reported that Putin sent eight ships to the Black Sea and circled the area where the Moscow ship sank, and the rescue efforts were continuing in this way. So what is Putin doing on his? sinking ship? Navy experts believe that the Russians are after the encryption devices and some missiles found on the ship. It is said that Putin, who wants to save unexploded missiles from the wreck, also wants to remove the bodies of the crew of the ship who lost their lives from the water. Because the families of the Navy soldiers on board made statements accusing the Kremlin, the incident caused a worldwide outcry. A few days ago, the mother of a Russian soldier who spoke to an opposition media outlet in Russia claimed that 40 soldiers were killed and many wounded on the Moscow cruiser. One of the flagships of the Russian Navy.